हेलो एवरी वन आई एम कपिल एंड वेलकम टू द एनेटन वीडियो टूडे वी आर गोइंग टू क्रिएट समथिंग सुपर स्मार्ट एंड सुपर यूजफुल एन ए आई पावर्ड इन्वेंट्री मैनेजमेंट सिस्टम यूजिंग एनेटन ओपन ए आई एंड गूगल शीट बिफोर वी गेट हैंड्स ऑन लेट्स क्विकली टॉक अबाउट एन एट एन नाउ डोंट वरी नो बोरिंग थ्योरी जस्ट वॉट यू नीड टू नो Anaten is a workflow automation tool that connect different apps and services without heavy coding. You can automate tasks, call APIs, plugin AI, and build some really smart system with ease. Think of it like your personal assistant. Open source, customizable, and super powerful. But hey, we are not going to deep into it today. If you are more curious check out more detailed videos on YouTube I believe in learning by practical so let's jump straight into practical part and start building first open your browser type n at n in Google Chrome or any other browser sign in into your account if you are new and at an offers a 14 day free trial so you are good to go you can also run it locally if you want but for this video we will use the cloud version of for simplicity all right i am already signed in now we will start creating a powerful intelligent inventory management system step by step it's a simple smart and super practical let's get building now here is the dashboard don't worry if you are not seeing look like that because i already created some workflow you can check out here now in this today video we will create an inventory management system so here is the dashboard you can check here is the admin panel uh, and simply you can <coughs> you can click on create workflow so in this video we are going to create a powerful ai agent that will help us manage our inventory like a pro smart fast and automatic let's get started first click on create workflow button in the top left corner of your anaton dashboard now before we start building let's quickly understand the three key building block of any automation workflow whether it is anaton or any other automation tool so these three are trigger filter action so what is trigger trigger is what start the workflow it could be something like a form submitted and the second one is filter this is how we decide whether to move forward or not for example we can say only continue if stock is below 5 and the third one is action it is what happens after the trigger and filter it could be like writing into google sheet or sending an email these three trigger filter and action are the heart of every automation all right now that you know the basics let's actually start building our inventory system step by step using these three trust me once you understand this logic you will be able to automate so many things in your daily life and work and it's feel like magical so let's get started now click on this plus icon you can here see what trigger this workflow a trigger is a step that start your workflow now you can see here trigger manually on a scheduled on a web hook call in this video we are going to use on chat messages you can see here like this don't worry i will explain you each thing step by step so here you can see we are successfully added chat message so if you click on this icon we can check if i type hi and send you can here see no response so don't worry we successfully added chat messages now we are going to click on this icon and add an ai agent just type ai agent 
सो बेसिकली दिस ए आई एजेंट है थ्री पार्ट अ चेट मॉडल अ मेमोरी एंड अ टूल सो वॉट इज चेट मॉडल चेट मॉडल इज बेसिकली लाइक आवर गूगल जेमिन आई डीप सी ग्रो एंड ओपन ए आई सो इन दिस वीडियो वी आर यूजिंग ओपन ए आई सो क्लिक ऑन ओपन ए आई आई विल टाइप ओपन ए आई नाउ डोंट वरी एन एट एन गिव यू फ्री ओपन ए आई क्रेडिट्स जस्ट इन दिस क्रीडेंशियल पार्ट यू कैन क्लेम यूर फ्री क्रीडेंशियल आई ऑलरेडी क्लेम एंड यू कैन सिलेक्ट यूर जी पी टी मॉडल इन दिस वीडियो वी आर यूजिंग जी पी टी फोर ओ मिनी सो बेसिकली वी आर एडेड थ्री थिंग अ चेट एन ए आई एजेंट एन चेट मॉडल सो इफ यू जस्ट ओपन चेट हियर एंड टाइप हाई सो यू कैन सी हेलो हाउ कैन आई एसिस्ट यू टूडे दिस रिप्लाई कम फ्रॉम ओपन ए आई चेट मॉडल यू कैन चेक यू कैन सी हियर आई जस्ट टाइप Hi and output is hello. How can I assist you today? Now, if I say my name is my name is Ram, so you can check here. Hello, Ram. How can I assist you? If I want to ask what is my name, so you can see here. I'm sorry. but i don't have access to personal information about you including your name so basically what happened we are not give a, a memory so it is not remembered our name so in this anytime we are using memory so just click on this plus icon and select a simple memory you can quick your credential here You can see here context with Windows length are just five. If you want to add, you can also add. For simplicity, we are using just five as it is. And if we run our model again and just type, my name is my name is Ram. So you can see here, nice to meet you, Ram. How can I assist you today? If I want to ask, what is my name? So it will. Give reply, Ram. So you can check here. Your name is Ram. How can I help you today? So it what happens? We provide a memory, so it will remember our task, our actions. Okay. So I hope that you understand till now what we are going to create. Now move to next part. so in the next part you can add your tools so tools like your google sheet you can add gmail you can add anything but for the simplicity and we are creating an inventory management system so we can just type sheet you can here see google sheet read update write data to google sheet just click on don't worry i will explain you each part what is here so in the credential you can connect your google account i already created and uh, connected so, so in tool description just uh, leave as it is and in the operation so in this operation we are uh, first operation is get rows and in the document part so which sheet we want to access so here already i created an entire inventory i you can see here an entire inventory and in this my sheet there are few things like apple mango papaya and these are item count and these are fruits you can give any name i simply gave an add an inventory system and we can just click on add an inventory because it is the same name which we gave in our google sheet so i just click on edit an inventory we successfully edit documents and in the sheet part what we have to click we are accessing sheet 1 you can check here we are sheet 1 here now we can add another sheet which will operation like append or 
update our seed so just type here sheet again and in the credential part we are using same account so just leave as it is and uh, in the operation part we are using append for update row and in the document section we are using our annotate inventory so we are using this and from list we are using sheet 1 so in column to match on we are using fruits so values to send we just click let the model define this parameter in the item count let the model define ok we are successfully created now let's run so open chat and here type how many item how many fruits item in my sheet so you can check here here are four item apple whose quantity is 10 mango item quantity is 20 papaya item count is 60 and grape 30 now if you want to add some another fruits we can easily add just type here add 50 oranges in my sheet and just hit enter now just wait you can see a message i have successfully added 50 oranges to your seed if you need to further assistant you can feel to ask now if we check our and our google seed we can here simply check the oranges are simply added so that's all about how we are using workflow now if you want to share your workflow and sell anyone just double click on chat and make chat publicly available just and you can see here a url link i will click on this url and just paste in my google chrome you can see here there is error why this error because we are not activate our workflow so we have to just click on here first we have to save here and click on active if you go on the, our same link and just refresh you can see here hi there my name is Nathan how can I assist you and you can run your workflow if I type just here update my oranges fifty to ninety and just hit enter. You can see here I have successfully updated the count of oranges fifty to ninety. And you can check easily on your Google Sheet. Here your item is just updated. So that's all about a simple inventory management system in the NATM. If you have any query, you can ask me directly. So thank you for this video.